Hello and welcome to a special COVID-19 update made especially for members of the HBA of Raleigh Wake County. I'm Paul Kane, your executive officer, and moments ago, Wake County Board of Commissioners announced a new stay-at-home order effective throughout Wake County and all of the municipalities within Wake County. In this video, I'm going to briefly run through uh, the highlights of this order and then the actual order with the, uh, the highlighted parts are going to be available uh, with this video so that you can download it and review it. The first thing to note is that this order is in fact a stay at home order. They are asking all residents of Wake County to stay home unless you're uh, out and about for the reasons that are specified in this order like buying food, going to the doctor, things of this nature. And there's a special section in it for certain businesses that are allowed to continue operating even during this order called essential services. Under section 10 of this order, commercial and residential construction professions and trades are included as essential businesses that may continue to operate. They further define this as including but not limited to contractors, engineers, architects, surveyors, suppliers and manufacturers, repairs and renovation specialists. Provided social distancing practices are used as outlined in section 12. And I'm going to talk more about that in a minute because there's some very important things that we need to know in honoring this order. Um, and, and one of the things that's in this that I have not seen in a lot of other orders is actually allowing for repairs and renovation specialists. And that's good news for our remodelers council. As you also know, the membership within our organization is very broad and not just limited to uh, home builders. It's anybody who's in the residential construction industry. And there's a number of other businesses which were specifically listed as essential and therefore exempt from the stay at home order. Uh, quickly, those include uh, banks, uh, insurance companies, financial institutions, hardware and supply stores. And yes, uh, I did contact the county commissioners and supply stores include uh, the building supply companies uh, that are such great supporters of our organization plumbers, electricians, heating and air specialists, exterminators, um, custodial and other service providers, landscape, lawn maintenance companies. Um, and then there's a, a special exception which I think would encompass most all of the members within our organization. It says businesses that supply other exempt businesses with the support or supplies necessary to operate. Um, and that is under section 10 T is in Tom. Uh, that's a very uh, uh, broad uh, exemption that I think applies to many of the members of our association. Uh, moving on, professional services such as legal services, accounting services, uh, process servers, insurance services, notary services, uh, professional real estate services such as realtors, appraisers, notary services, title insurers, and inspectors. And again, that's another uh, exempt organization from the stay-at-home order. Um, that, that uh, oftentimes we've not seen other jurisdictions do. So we're very pleased uh, that Wake County included them within this order as exempt. As a final note, it's important that we, uh, the honor section 12, which is the social distancing part, the county commissioners uh, granted our industry the right to continue working when others cannot. And so we really need to pay heed to the social distancing requirements. We have to keep our individual members safe. We have to keep the industry safe five simple things and we've heard them all before. Six foot distancing between individuals, washing hands for 20 seconds and washing often, uh, covering coughs with your sleeve and not your hands, uh, cleaning high touch surfaces, that's a big deal on the job site, and not shaking hands, that's it. Five simple things uh, in order to honor the, uh, the privilege the county commissioners have given our industry to keep operating. In closing, I'd like to uh, give special thanks to Suzanne Harris for all the great work she's done on this and also to all the members of the Board of County Commissioners who talk to us, listen to us, and help come up with a, a product that I think is one of the best stay-at-home orders that I've seen. So if you want more details, you can download it and read it yourself. And in the meantime, stay safe.